really enjoy the strategy behind it. The, the playing against another person in kind of a chess match. I'm glad over the last 10, 15 years, the fitness aspect has really come into our sport. Extreme now. Uh, it never used to be like that back when we were kind of getting started in the mid 90s, early 90s. Nobody was in the gym, nobody was working out that hard. Uh, now, as you can tell on the ice, the guys are in incredible shape. Um, it's becoming a younger and younger person sport. It used to be the champions ages were, you know, mid to high 30s. Now your champions are mid to high 20s. We can't worry about that. It's just a, you know, one thing about curling now, the teams are also even and so good. So we're in the final eight, but I tell you that the final eight are really even. So, you know, it'll be tough, but we'll, uh, we'll give it a go. I think that Kevin is, you know, arguably one of the one of the greatest ever to play the game, and in, in terms of strategy and shot making, and uh, yeah, I mean, he's a really fierce competitor. Dave is well, it's his throwing. I've watched thousands of his rocks against us, and he made most of them. <laughs> so, so uh, he's a welcome guy on the team, and shooting very well so far. We don't change very often, no. But Dave Nedwin came on the team this year, you know, in an attempt to get to Sochi, and. And he's fit in awfully well. The old team with John Morris on the team, that was seven years. You know, we won two Briars as a team. We won a ton of Grand Slams. We won a lot of uh, WCT events. And you know, our biggest thing as a team, obviously, and, and I think the reason we get the recognition we do is because we won the Olympics in our home country. Some people throw things out there, you know, like we had six of the best years ever. We were one of the greatest teams ever, but there's been so many good teams. And, and even now, you know, the game's changed where, you know, not one team's dominating anymore like uh, we used to do and like Glenn Howard used to do and teams like that, right? So we needed a change. You know, we didn't have a great year last year. And, you know, I think for what our team needs right now, Dave, Dave's the right guy. And, you know, we're going to keep the gas pedal down, hopefully peak for December and uh, see if we can do some damage at the trials. Ben, ben just has this ability, no matter what he does, he wins. You know, he's a winner. He's a very, very competitive. He's very feisty. He hates to lose. Uh, he works really hard. So he brings all these great elements to a team and uh, pushes you to be better and better and better. And on top of that, he's, he's one of my best friends. So we get along well out there, we communicate well, we know what makes each other tick. Bringing a new player on can be difficult sometimes. We had the same team for seven years, so it adds a whole new element to our team. Getting a chance to play some golf is, is really important. And I think we've, we've developed a great team chemistry. We've only been together for a couple months and so far so good. So yeah, nice to get on the course for a little while. We don't get a lot of golf in. Other than Ben, Ben plays a lot of golf. Eagle, <laughs> up in that bitch! Golf's fun, I mean, I, I play quite a bit. For us to be able to get out here and, and, and bang it around, is, it's a lot of fun, especially when the four of us do it. The first thing we did as a group was uh, go to the golf course and, and play a little bit of two-man scramble, which we've carried on a few times since then. So, um, I don't know, it's a similar kind of mind frame to, to curling, you know, picking your shots and your clubs. And, you know, for us, it's a great way to socialize and get out and do something that's, that's uh, an activity together. You know, Kevin's a great guy off the ice, you know, even, even on the ice, you know, when we're winning, he's a really good guy. When, when you're losing, he's no different than anybody else. He's, he's very competitive and he wants to win, and no different than myself or Mark or Dave or, you know, any of the other top teams. The one thing I know is that uh, when it comes down to the end of the game, if, if Kevin's got a, the rock in his hands and a, and a chance to win, he's not going to miss very often. I love playing in tough games and, and the pressure. Totally enjoy it. So I'd love to get to a fourth Olympics, but you know, they say you're the, the best or the worst. Uh, nothing I can do about that. All I can do is try to win all you can.